Have you ever wondered how to teach a cat to walk on a leash? The concept might seem a bit odd at first. After all, cats are known for their independent spirit. But believe it or not, leash training can offer a world of benefits for our feline companions, especially those who spend most of their lives indoors. It provides them with a safe way to explore the outside world, a chance to exercise, and a stimulating change of scenery. The process of training your cat to walk on a leash, however, requires a healthy dose of patience, understanding, and positive reinforcement. It's not about controlling your cat, but rather about teaching them to feel comfortable and secure on a leash. So, if you're ready to embark on this journey, let's dive right into the first step. The first step in leash training your cat is making the harness a friend, not a foe. A positive association is the foundation of this process. We can achieve this by introducing the harness during feeding time, a moment your cat already associates with joy and satisfaction. This way, your cat will start to link the harness with something pleasant. However, comfort is key. Make sure the harness isn't too tight. We don't want fur caught in the clasp, causing discomfort. If your cat resists, don't push it. Stop and try again later, maybe when they're a bit hungrier and more willing to tolerate the harness for the sake of a meal. Remember, if your cat lies down, don't pull on the leash. We're not about force here, we're about positive association and gradual learning. Remember, patience is key. It may take some time for your cat to get used to the harness, but persistence will pay off. Once your cat is comfortable with the harness, it's time to start the training sessions. These should be short and sweet happening twice a day. Consistency is key here, as cats are creatures of habit. Now is also an excellent time to introduce a clicker into the mix. This little device makes a distinct sound that your cat will learn to associate with good behavior and rewards. Remember, always click at the exact moment your cat does what you want, then immediately give a treat. As you progress with the training, it's crucial to achieve each training goal before moving to the next. Cats are masters of focus, but only on one thing at a time. So let's not overwhelm our feline friends. And let's not forget, patience is a virtue. If your cat looks scared or tries to wriggle out of the harness, it might be an indication that you're moving too fast. The goal here is to make your cat comfortable and confident while wearing the harness and responding to the clicker. When your cat is responding well to the clicker, it's time to introduce the leash. Now, we aren't just slapping the leash on and expecting our feline friends to take it in stride. No, this is a gradual process. Consider the leash as an extension of your bond with your cat. Start by letting your cat get familiar with the leash, allowing them to sniff it, play with it, and feel comfortable around it. Then attach the leash to the harness, but keep it slack. Let your cat walk around with it. Observe their movements, their comfort level. You're not attempting to lead them, not yet. As your cat becomes more accustomed to the leash, you can begin to slowly tighten it. This is not a rapid process. We're not yanking, we're gently drawing it in. And remember treats are your ally here. Reward your cat for their bravery and willingness to try something new. Remember the leash is not a tool for pulling or dragging your cat. It's a safety device to help your cat explore the outside world. Training a cat to walk on a leash is a process, but with patience and positivity, you can help your cat embrace this new adventure. It all starts with creating a positive association with the harness. Make it a pleasant experience by introducing the harness at feeding time. Remember, don't rush, keep the sessions short and sweet twice a day. Each stage of the training should be a step forward, so it's crucial to achieve your goal at each one before moving on. To expedite the learning process, a clicker could be your best friend. But remember, cats can be easily distracted. So, frequent encouragement is key. If your cat seems frightened or tries to wriggle out of the harness, it's a sign you might be moving too fast. Slow down, be patient, and keep the experience positive. Remember, every cat is unique. What works for one might not work for another, but with patience and persistence, you can help your feline friend enjoy the great outdoors safely and securely.